What's up, y'all? What's happening? Coach C, what it is, man? Before you get your day started, I got a little motivational tip for you. I got something for you to think about. I got something for you to contemplate, something to put in your brain. You know what I'm talking about, man. You know what it is. All right, so here's what I want you to think about. Majority, minority, majority, minority, majority, minority. Do you want to be the majority? Do you want to be the minority? Well, let me just explain something about these two terms. The majority people live their lives and they're unfulfilled and they do not have the health that they want. They do not have the, the, the physical part of the body that they don't have, but they also don't have the mental side of the body that they would like that makes them happy, that makes them feel amazing. You know, I'm not talking about six packs and all this other crap. I ain't talking about that stuff. I'm talking about just a good feeling inside your body. When you walk around, you feel good in your jeans. You feel good with all these different things. That's what I'm talking about. Majority of people do not have that. There's a small percentage of the minority of people who actually do. There's about 2%, 98%. Now, what does that mean to you? Why is that important? Why is it important that a lot of people and most people do not live a healthy lifestyle? Most people do not work out. Most people do not take care of themselves enough to feel amazing. Because there is a small percentage of people that actually do and they feel amazing and they're walking around and they're doing what they want to do and they're feeling like they want to feel and they're living the lives that they want. And they're feeling fulfilled. Do you want to be the major minority or do you want to be the majority? Now, there's one thing I read in a book that was a game changer for me just about two years ago. I read this book and it said, find out or figure out what everybody else is doing and do the exact opposite. Let me say that again. Find out what everybody else is doing and do the exact opposite. You want to live a good life? Don't do what everybody else is doing. You want, to, you want to feel good in your body? Don't do what everybody else is doing. You want to have good finances? Don't spend your money in the way that everybody else is spending it. You want to have good things in your life? Then you need to treat the things that you have in your life right now with special care. You need to figure out what it is that you are doing in your life right now and figure out how can I not be like everybody else. Perfect prime example. You go to the grocery store. Look around. See everybody putting boxing can foods inside of their, 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 their carts. You're seeing all this stuff going in there and it's crap. And you're seeing, look at the size of the bodies. Look how, how happy do they look. Do they look energetic? Do they look like they, they, they feel good all the time? I guarantee you they do not. So do the exact opposite of what those people are doing. If you see me in the grocery store... Go ahead, try to see. Try to see if I'm stuffing something inside of my car. Try to see that. And I'm walking around and I'm like, ooh, do, 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 do. Sometimes I got my headphones in. I'm like, yeah, man, I'm just going. I'm about to go get my workout on. You know what it is. You know what I'm saying? You got to, got to, got to not do what everybody else is doing. That's your tip of the day. Do not do what everybody else is doing. Be the minority, in this case, and not the majority. You guys have a wonderful day. This is Coach C. You know what it is. Peace out.